Understanding powers of 10 is a fundamental concept that allows us to express numbers in a concise and convenient way. In this lesson, we'll explore what powers of 10 are and how to calculate them. Powers of 10 represent numbers that are multiplied by 10 raised to a certain exponent. The exponent tells us how many times we need to multiply 10 by itself. Let's take a look at an example to understand this better. 10 to the power of 3. In this example, the exponent is 3. To calculate 10 to the power of 3, we multiply 10 by itself 3 times. 10 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 10 equals 1000. So 10 raised to the power of 3, or 10 to the power of 3, equals 1000. The result tells us that 10 to the power of 3 can easily be written as a 1 followed by 3 zeros, or 1000. Now that we understand what powers of 10 are, let's explore the rules for using mental math to multiply and divide by powers of 10. To multiply a number by a power of 10, we move the decimal point to the right by as many places as the exponent indicates. For example, multiply 6 decimal 2 by 10 to the power of 3. To do this, we move the decimal point 3 places to the right. So the final solution is 6 decimal 2 multiplied by 10 to the power of 3 equals 6,200. Notice that when we move the decimal point to the right, we add zeros to the end of the number. This shows that the number is growing as we increase the exponent. To divide a number by a power of 10, move the decimal point to the left by as many places as the exponent indicates. For example, divide 9,800 by 10 to the power of 2. To divide by 10 to the power of 2, we move the decimal point two places to the left. If the number doesn't have a decimal in it already, like how 9,800 doesn't have one, we add the decimal to the end of the number before moving it. Also, if you run out of places to move the decimal, because you get to the front of the number, add zeros to the beginning for each remaining space you have to move it. So the final solution after we move the decimal point left is 9,800 divided by 10 to the power of 2 equals 98 decimal zero zero. Note that any zeros that appear after a decimal point can be removed when writing your final answer, but only if it's just zeros. If there's any other number, we have to keep everything as it is. This allows us to write 98 decimal zero zero as just 98. However, if our answer were 98 decimal zero one, we would not be able to remove any digits after the decimal point without changing the number. In conclusion, by using mental math techniques, we can quickly determine the result when multiplying or dividing by powers of 10. Just remember the rules that we learned in this lesson. When multiplying a number by a power of 10, move the decimal point to the right by as many places as the exponent indicates, and when dividing by a power of 10, move the decimal point to the left by as many places as the exponent indicates. You can now practice applying these rules and techniques to become more proficient in working with powers of 10. Good luck.